Scam alert. Fake goods, including purses, high-end fashion clothing, and watches are popping up everywhere, including on Amazon. Here to tell us what's happening is Mary Beth Westmoreland. She's the Vice President of Technology at Amazon. Good to have you on our show. What are you doing at Amazon to fight fakes? I mean, look, counterfeiters are criminals. And they engage in a wide range of criminal behaviors, and we know that. Um, just about a year ago, Amazon launched our Counterfeit Crimes Unit, or as we call it, CCU. And this is a global team that's dedicated to pursuing bad actors and to holding them accountable to the fullest extent of the law. And in fact, the team is made up of former federal prosecutors, investigators, and analysts with expertise in, in catching and prosecuting these criminals. And they work really closely with law enforcement and with our brand partners to investigate and to litigate both criminal and civil suits. Um, in fact, we partnered with a smaller business like um, JL Children's, which is a U.S.-based family-owned company specializing in travel accessories. But we've also worked with brands like Yeti and GoPro and Hanes and Valentino. Um, we've referred over 250 counterfeiters for cr criminal investigation worldwide. We filed civil litigation against 64 counterfeiters, and we've disrupted counterfeiters and their supply chain networks globally. But I'll just say this. Our goal is not just to stop counterfeiters on Amazon, it's to, it's to stop them everywhere, stop them for good. What products do you see mostly as counterfeits and what are some trends? Well, I mean, we see trends um, across the, the board. Um, very, um, some of the trends that we see um, specifically on Amazon is that, you know, counterfeiters are trying to do things like falsify their names and their contact information to hide their identity. They manufacture fraudulent invoices and infringing packaging. They like they open and close their accounts constantly to detect, to try to evade our detection efforts, and then they collude with each other. And I'll give you an example of a place where we've recently seen it. Um, and I'll, I'll tell you a quick story um, about the luxury um, luxury product, fashion product market. Um, you know, we we recently announced a settlement where popular social media influencers on platforms like TikTok and Instagram, they were promoting and facilitating the sale of counterfeit luxury fashion goods. And these individuals, the way it worked is that they directed their followers and social media to product listings on Amazon stores, where that listing was actually just a normal, ordinary, generic product. But when those followers purchased that generic product, what they actually received was a counterfeit luxury good. And so while our protections, all of these, you know, this great tech and all these protections that we have on our stores prevented this seller from listing counterfeit, they had to get creative, which is why we need to continue to invest and continue to innovate to stay ahead of these counterfeiters. Thank you for your time today. Thank you. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.